Hey reefers, I wanted to do an update on my LPS tank. I came to the aquarium today off work and it's just, I, I showed you last time, look how it's just growing everywhere. Just nasty, just disgusting. And I, it killed one of my gobies. One of my gobies is dead. My spotted, orange spotted gobies dead. And attributed to this crap on the ground I had to pull them out. You could see where I pulled them out with um, a, a pair of um, tweezers and I moved the sand and they go away like, yeah, it's going to be a nice sand bed. Look how they just crawl back in and all my fish are just feeling horribly, you know, they don't eat, they don't have an appetite. Um, corals look really good. Rocks look good. Gravel looks disgusting. I'm about to start the... Um, the grids, the acrylic black grids on here with the skirt, but I'm waiting for my microscope to come in so I could really find out, ID these guys. And you can see it's just, it just it's horrible. I, I try to pause because it's, it's hard to see when I'm moving the, the phone. And I can put grids on all of this, and I'm about to, and even to the back, you can see that it just goes all the way back. Rocks, nothing, and my my panels, they're not clean, they're, they have good algae growing, but there's there you can see the algae on, on the wall. So, just one dead fish, it just really, really pisses me off that I come home and, and, and I have to go through this. It makes you just wanna reboot the aquarium, but I'm patient. And I'm going to show you the other aquarium. Let me let me put you on pause so you can see. Take a look at the gravel. Just, these guys are just all over the place. This this aquarium was a little bit behind my other aquarium. Look, we'll identify them tomorrow. Let me go to the other aquarium. The first thing you're going to see is look at the gravel, white. Okay, white over there. Little spot over there in the corner, but. In the areas that there is gravel, white. So I'm hurting it. This might even be algae. I'm not sure. But I'm keeping to the blackout and just applying it. My corals really took a massive hit. All the SPS corals here have because my phosphates went from 0.04 to 0.13. So, and my nitrates were like at 12. I lost already frags. This one I'm already losing, you can see. Totally, I don't know if it'll come back. Just the colors are just really, really messed up. Um, this one here, just dying. My digitata is the only thing that's doing good, and 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 uh, a couple that are making it through the phosphate. Okay, Slimer, green Slimer, just incredibly strength on here. But look, on here. I don't want to take off the, the, the plates, but I'm about to spring these plates on the other one after I get an ID for my um, microscope coming in, get an ID on the other ones, but I'm about to, so I can, that should be covered in dinos. I'm affecting them somehow and I'm, I'm just gonna keep to it and and then bring down, slowly bring down the, um, the uh, nitrates and the phosphates down to the level I had gone three days thinking that my corals were bringing down nitrates and phosphates and they weren't. So um, be alarmed that you must test every day because your corals are not going to bring down the levels that you thought with my chato working. The only thing I can say is that take a look over there. Look, these spots which before would have little remnants of at this time, they're not there. Just the spots there. And I got good old trochus snail eating up on there. So I'm just gonna let him dig out. I'm gonna clean, I'm gonna clean the, the, uh, the walls on there. But I just wanted to share that my aquarium, the LPS, let me go show you that one real quick. Take a look at that. Look at all that. I'm, I'm letting this grow so you guys could see. No grid, they go to town. These tanks both had about the same amount of time and they're happy destructing they already killed one of my one of my gobies 
on there. I didn't clean the, the panel so you can see that I have good algae growing inside, but they're just happily growing. I'm about to block them out as soon as I ID them tomorrow. I'm just sick and tired. And look, the movement of where I moved it, they all run away and it goes all white. They all, they all run and duck for cover. But I'm going to produce the light on here. Rejection of the light, I should say. And we'll see what ends up happening. And this tank looks really good, but the fish are really, 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 really bad. Any question, comments, please ask. Thanks.